So a new season on the horizon, a slightly different role and challenge for you, I guess, Elliot. But are you looking forward to what this season will bring? Yeah, definitely. It's exciting. Um, we've obviously got some new signings uh, on the back of a good year last year, and but it's a fresh start for us. And yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a good year, and uh, I'm just excited to get going now. And you know, another year under Willie Peters. Are you enjoying being under him and what he's brought to the club? Yeah, I love it. He's a he's a great great coach, great fella, and. Um, Got us playing some good rugby, and you know we all enjoy it. We bought into what he's about, and um, you know, we, yeah, we love love working with him. So yeah, looking forward to it again. And a, a strong 2023. Do you feel like you've set yourself a platform to really kick on and challenge this year? Yeah, but it doesn't mean anything. It's gone now. It's a fresh start. You know, everyone starts uh, in February on on zero points, and no one's won anything. So we'll take confidence from it. But at the end of the day, it's a new year. It's a new it's a new start. So we're looking forward to to going after it again. You mentioned some of those new signings. They won't have experienced what round one he's going to bring. You know about the whole derby pretty well. What's it like to play? It's great, I love it. Uh, it's a great atmosphere, it's hostile. Um, obviously going away, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good place to go. It's a hostile place, great atmosphere. And yeah, I love it and look forward to it. And it's a great start, no better way to start. I can't wait for it. And on a personal level, is that the game that you look forward to most? It's one that sticks out in the calendar, but they're all as important as each other. At the end of the day, it's only worth two points, just as the one the next week and the week after that. So. Um, yeah, it adds a bit more to us as, as a, you know local rivals, but at the end of the day, the, the, the game the week after is just as big and the one after that and so on. So we don't get too caught up in all that, let the fans get caught up in, in the emotions and we'll concentrate on playing the game. Is that the kind of game where you're you know more conscious perhaps that your leadership is particularly important? Yeah, definitely. Obviously, like I said, the atmosphere is always uh, intense and uh, it's always an aggressive game and obviously you've got to keep a cool head on on your shoulders and yeah you obviously lead by example but um, it's just another game you know at the end of the day it's worth two points and um, yeah as much as it's hostile we, we, we like that environment and we'll, we'll relish the challenge. How's pre-season been coming into this? Good yeah it's been tough always tough but uh, we enjoy it you know you feel you're feeling good physical shape and uh, good to get to know the, the, the new lads let them fit into our systems and yeah we're, we're in a good spot. Have you set yourself any kind of individual Markers, targets that you want to hit this season? No, not at all. Um, it's not a box. It's not an individual sport. You know, we're a team, and we'll have our own team goals. But as an individual, now it's, I'm just a cog in a in a machine that works pretty well, and we want to be working well this year. Well, best of luck this season, mate. Thank you.